a number of fans on social media are mad at Patrick Reed for cheating again following his actions at the Arnold Palmer Invitational. While Patrick Reed has been accused of cheating before, this time he was caught red-handed and fans found it peculiar that such a good player follows such unfair means which is embarrassing. But how did Patrick cheat and why? Let's take a look at it in this video. For those who don't know, Patrick Reed is a pro-American golfer who competes on both the PGA and European tours. He has 9 victories on the PGA Tour, including one major event, the 2018 Masters Tournament. Patrick has also won two World Golf Tournaments, the WDC Cadillac Championship in 2014 and the WGC Mexican Championship in 2020. Reed has competed for the United States in team games including the Ryder Cup and President Cup. He has earned the nickname Captain America thanks to his performances. However, dating back to his undergraduate golf days at UGA and Augusta State, Reed has been accused of breaking several regulations which he has always strongly denied. He was heavily scrutinized for an infraction committed at the 2019 Hero World Challenge. While leading in the tournament, Reed moved to the sand behind his ball in a waste area twice, ostensibly improving his lie to which Reed responded by saying he had not noticed the movement and blamed his lack of realization on his angle compared to the camera. Reed received the two-stroke penalty for his lie. He faced harsh criticism for his actions from players and analysts alike. On another occasion, Reed was awarded a free relief for an embedded ball in the rough on the 10th hole during the third round of the Farmers Insurance Open in 2021. Reed had marked and picked up his ball to verify the lie before a rules official arrived. The official ended up validating his claim to relief because none of Reed's playing companions or the volunteers in the area had seen the ball bounce. The ball appeared to bounce once in the rough before coming to rest in the video prompting some to wonder if it were genuinely embedded. Despite the apparent quarrel, two authorities eventually verified that Reed had obeyed the rules of golf correctly. The infamous golfer found himself in another cheating incident after he was found picking up his ball and moving the line before authorities could determine if it were embedded. Reed was caught in a cheating incident last year when fans accused him of improving his lie and was once again in the spotlight at the Farmers Insurance Open. At the 10th hole, the American shot the ball outside the fairway and Reed said that the ball did not bounce and was lodged in the air. However, replay showed that the ball bounced once before landing in dense grass. When Reed came at the ball, he questioned if it had bounced. The volunteer responded in the negative. However, controversy developed when Reed decided to move the ball after announcing he was going to inspect it. Reed shifted the ball to a new location and summoned the rules official. Reed informed the official that the ball did not bounce and asked him to determine if the ball had broken the ground. The rules officer agreed that the ball had broken the ground and Reed was given embedded ball relief. With a much better line, Reed goes up and down for par. Fans and analysts questioned whether Reed had the right to pick up the ball before an official arrived. Many more fans on social media blasted Reed and accused him of cheating, claiming that the ball bounced casting doubt on the ball's capacity to be implanted. Reed later justified his actions, claiming that the event was not a problem for the authorities. We can't see everything while we're out there, Reed told CBS. You have to go by what the authorities say and the rules authorities say when that happens. When everything is said and done, we believe we did the correct thing, and the rules officials stated that we did everything perfectly. With it out of the way, we went on and simply kept playing, he continued. Reed has already faced charges of cheating. The most famous incident occurred at the Hero World Challenge in the Bahamas in 2021 when he was discovered grounding his club in a bunker before hitting the ball, which is against the sports regulations. Most recently at the Farmers Insurance Open, Reed won with a 5-shot victory and it was no short of controversy. The players played the bad guy more often than any other player more recently. Reed didn't get the benefit of the doubt this time. Officials exonerated Reed who had pleaded his innocence following another cheating scandal. In the eyes of the public, however, it didn't matter. The 30-year-old Reed was declared guilty again, and his history in golf has been plagued with cheating. Reed attended the University of Georgia before he was removed from the squad due to suspicion of cheating and theft. Reed rejects the charges which were made in Shane Ryan's book, Slaying the Tiger, a year inside the ropes on the new PGA Tour. He claims he was kicked off due to alcohol-related infractions, but a statement from Georgia assistant golf coach Jason Payne paints a different image. While getting to know Patrick as a coach throughout the recruitment process, a few character flaws surfaced that we as coaches believe we could assist Patrick with, Payne said. While there are no questions about Patrick's ability as a golfer, we elected not to identify him as a person. Shane Ryan's narrative is a true description of his time at the University of Georgia, including the concerns held by his former teammates. 
Reed called himself a top 5 player in the world before ever competing in a major. Reed won the Masters in 2018, but his cheating controversy far outshadows his successes on the golf course. What do you think of Patrick Reed's future? Do let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.